this morning we're talking namaste. One studio right here in the upstate is using adaptive yoga to helping people of all abilities gain strength, flexibility, and a peace of mind. South Carolina's own Curieville takes us to class. Whether you have mobility issues, a chronic disease, or are just a beginner to yoga, this class may be for you. So we are gonna start wherever you would like. In a studio that overlooks the Swamp Rabbit Trail. How you can turn obstacles you face into opportunities. Is a class that encourages all. But just try to get really comfortable. It's called adaptive and yoga. Up and as you breathe out, it helps it float down. It really helps me with my spasticity in my back between my shoulder blades and my legs. A drunk driver hit Hunter Lawrence in 2020, leaving him paralyzed from the chest down. It broke several ribs, broke my sternum, lacerated my spleen, and collapsed my left lung. To stay healthy, he needs to continue moving his lower body. And then as I cue you, you'd squeeze your bottom. Otherwise, he can end up with a serious blood clot. And exhale down. Which can turn into a pulmonary embolism and travel to your lungs and your heart. Adaptive yoga is keeping that blood flowing. And turn your hands out and then push the air down. Yoga allows you to practice mindfulness, breath work, and being present. And whether that's through just breath work, whether that's through moving your body, that's an important practice for everyone to have. Amanda Madry is also trained as an occupational therapist, so she knows how to handle people with mobility challenges. You could expect the class to be modified to fit your needs. So. It really could be if you have back pain, if you have a spinal cord injury, if you have an amputation, if you have arthritis, you know, it's yoga for anyone and everyone. You can be sitting in a chair, lying on the ground, or using a mobility aid. And as you breathe out, you're letting it go. Hunter says in the year that he has taken up yoga, he has seen big changes. I learned a lot of new stretches that I was not taught in physical therapy to adapt to being able to do yoga, specifically in the wheelchair. And then as you exhale, just gently sweep your arm down, tucking your chin in towards your chest. It's worth a try. Oh. Hunter says the breathing exercises they do in yoga also help with his anxiety and trauma from that car accident. Prisma Health is offering a free adaptive yoga class on Friday, September 27th at the Roger C. Peace Adaptive Sports and Wellness Center, which is the new building by Unity Park. They will also be offering yoga classes for people with brain injuries. To learn more about all of these, visit our website at foxcarolina.com. Carrie Beal, Fox Carolina News.